Hi, it's Deborah from Beacon of Light, and I have Thelma here with me. Today is Monday, February 27th. Hope everybody's doing well. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Um, so, I still have... Here, bro. Here, Kiki. Come on, baby. Come on, say hi. Come say hi, baby. Come on, come on. Put Thelma on film. All right, good. All right. <laughs> all right, let's see what today's energy is going to be all about. Um, I kind of feel like... Uh, it's a uh, it's a very exploratory energy. Um, something I heard this morning was um, I repeated something about how I, I keep I keep finding myself doing blah blah blah, and the key word was I keep finding myself. <clears throat> so let's see what comes up with this reading because um, as I going through my own thoughts, I keep saying the same words over again, which is. I keep finding myself doing blah, blah, blah. So um, I think this whole process today where the energies that we're experiencing right now is more about finding yourself doing certain things. Uh, finding yourself... Oop, did I just see a card that was turned over? Maybe not. I don't know. Um, maybe that was just me. There it is. There it is. All right. The three cards... Um, if you're finding yourself you're pretty much through trials and tribulations and experiences, you're finding who you are. You're finding yourself. You're finding out what makes you tick. And sometimes that takes a lot of um, experiences to figure it out. Um, I, I'm on this amazing journey of, of life to, to find out more about what makes me tick and my soul and what... what um, you know, what is, is my purpose and what, what I'm going to do with this and finding who I am through this process. So I think we're all on that same journey, just in a different way. I want to just pull, I don't, I'm going to turn this over as soon as it, if it comes out face up, but I just want to pull an affirmation to go with this when I start reading this real quick to see how it matches up. I just uh, feel like that there is a, um, in a very exploratory time right now as we find ourselves. Um, and another thing is I keep hearing that song, Wake Me Up. Um, and there's a part of in that lyric in that song that says, I keep, um, this is, I'm finding myself to find um, that I, I didn't even know I was lost, something like that. Don't quote me on those quotes, <laughs> those lyrics. I know I don't have it right. Okay, one card fell out. I don't know what it is. I'm just going to put it down here for the bottom, at the for the end. First card here is the Queen of Cups in reverse, and then we have the Two of Wands, and then we have the Ace of Cups in reverse. So this Queen of Cups, she wants emotional fulfillment. She is ready to offer her cup of love to others because she knows how to manage it for herself. It's in reverse. And look, here's your journey. <laughs> um, what if the journey itself is to discover that cup of love, especially when you have that cup of love for yourself right here. Ace is number one. You are number one. Um, can't make this stuff up. As I was talking about it, these are the cards that kind of fell out. Maybe the journey to finding yourself is through love, is through your emotions, is through um, exploring all of the different facets of your life's experiences emotionally. Um, and if we can just see that there is two paths, one might be a more logical approach and one might be a more emotional approach, I would say our key to finding which path and as you can see there's no wrong answer here but maybe our key is through love through self-love so um i'm thinking we need to turn these guys around and let's get on a path of love let's get on a path of finding ourselves through love finding ourselves through our experiences and shining that light on ourself and what emotionally fulfills us what emotionally um how we feel about things will drive which path we take because it's about emotion our emotions are key to us 
If it feels good, go do it. If it doesn't feel good, it's either not the right time or it's not the right thing for you. Let's see what this affirmation card is all about. Worthy, of course. You, my dear, are enough. You are enough for your most daring of hopes. You are enough for your deepest of desires. You are enough for the purest of love. And you have enough strength to conquer your darkest of fears. You, my love, are enough for abundance beyond measure. In being created, you are, by default, worthy of the life of your wildest dreams. And here comes Thelma again, just to solidify that message. Right, Thelma? We are enough. Right? Come here, baby girl. Say hi to everybody that you love them. And also love yourself in the process. Okay. I hope this helps. I hope this makes sense. It does to me. And I hope everyone has an amazing day. Thanks so much. Bye.